Hi, I'm Laura Wright and I'm about to start a teaching position at Luther College and I've heard that you have questions about dating things and how do you date them and that you've been using the terms BC and AD and you may not have known what they mean and known other ways to compare them, other ways of dating. So first we're going to talk about what those mean. BC means before Christ and AD is a Latin term for Anno Domino which means the year of our Lord. And it actually starts with the year that Jesus was born, or that we think that Jesus was born, and we count up from that. Now, we have actually changed, probably within the last um, few decades, in the ways that we talk about dating things, because we recognize that everybody isn't Christian. And so we've begun to use the terms BCE and CE, which refers to before the Common Era and Common Era. And the dating is exactly the same as BC and AD, but it's a recognition that we aren't all Christian and out of respect for others who might not be Christian and date things with regard to Jesus. But also, if you go into other cultures, especially around here, you'll see different ways of dating things. So if I were to go over to Jordan and read, say, an archaeological report there, in the beginning of it, it would actually have a date that would say AH, and it would talk about after the Hajj that Muhammad went on, and they would date things based upon um, Muhammad's date, the date he went to Mecca. You can also see in ancient cultures, there's another way to date things, and I'll give you one example in Mesopotamia, and that is with the Assyrian people, and they had a list, and there was an official, and these officials just came one right after the other, and they kept this list, and the name of the official was a limu, and so you would date things based upon the limu of that year, and you would write it in your text, and so we can go back, and we can actually make those dates correspond to our own BCE and CE dates, and date things that happened thousands of years ago. I hope that helps you understand um, the ways that we date things as people in the Western world and how that differs from others who might date things based upon Muhammad and even ancient peoples and how they formed their calendars.